It's a lovely misty morning out at Milnerton Training Stables. We're chatting to Des McCutton from the Monden International Racing Stables about his runners at Hollywood Bets Kenilworth on Saturday, 20th of April. Des, thanks so much for your time. Um, so you are starting out in race one, 1,000 metre maiden juvenile plate. Um, your day being two babies, starting with dashing home, two-year-old Futura Colt out of Electromare and then Flying Bomb, two-year-old elusive Fort Gelding from a Centenary Mare. Uh, dashing home, jumping from the three draw with Mornay Venar, and Flying Bomb has the 10 draw and Bernard Fadehove on board. What can you tell us about these two? Obviously, I think they're going to be a little bit green, you know, I haven't seen Kenilworth at all yet. Uh, I expect them to go a little bit further, but I've got to start with them, you know, they're rising three and I've got a small string, so I've got to start running some of these younger horses and just hoping for a decent debut, that's all. Super. And then moving on to race nine, the 1600 meter class four, 12 horse field here, and your saddling stable favorite, Le Ligionnet, three year old racing Getrix. He's got the nine draw, 60 and a half to shoulder, and Bernard Fade her, but he knows him well. And he's coming off that win over a mile not so long ago, so that's great. And then all about Ronnie. Um, he's drawn 12 this time out, 58 and a half, and Richard Furry on board. Um, also won over a mile two starts ago and back down to that trip here. How are these two doing at the moment? They're both doing extremely well. There's not much between the two of them. Uh, obviously, the draw is not going to be in the favour of All About Ronnie. And uh, I think he'll appreciate the extra 200 last time. It was over the 1400 he was running on. So I can't judge between the two, so it's whoever gets the first run, but it is a very competitive field and I hope they can just run or reproduce similar runs they gave me last time.